Hey guys, my name is Rudy, and uh, we're going to continue our project from yesterday. So yesterday, I came up with the idea to put another little plate over the existing plate, and I got a bunch of emails and questions as to, did I destroy the Rampage sign, and whatnot. So I decided to kind of expand upon this. I kind of had an epiphany over this. It's going to look more like this. So here's what I did. I went down to Hobby Lobby and spent a whopping $3. Went ahead and I bought half a yard of black cotton material. And with this, all you're going to need is a tape measure, yardstick, marker, and some Velcro. I like this type of Velcro. See that here? This dual lock. And what I did is I cut 17 and 3 eighths in size here. So 3 eighths to half. And I trimmed it off the side of this. And I made the length a little bit longer. Enough to kind of cover the, the material. So here's what I have. To make this work, or make this work better, sorry, I've got one handed again here. And I take it and I've laid out some Velcro back here. You want to be careful not to get over the sticker because it will rip the sticker. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this off and pull this one off here. And what this is, is you're looking at the top part of another piece. I'm going to attach this to the cloth here. So what I want to do is I want to make sure it's straight. And if you lay it across there very lightly, like I just did. Now what you want to do is, I think I already showed you guys how to put up the sign. So the sign here is Velcroed ever so slightly right here in the center and with this black part it's almost impossible to see so anyway I'm going to put this back up fairly centered oh yeah and the sign itself we got a little bit of a dual lock on here too so we're gonna put the sign up I'm gonna put pull this down make it nice and even And now, it looks like a burger time machine. Now finish this, we're going to go ahead and press slightly up here, and up here. And if this works out, I may have this sewn in my local alterations shop. You don't want to put too hard on here, just enough pressure to keep it from coming off. I mean, it's, it's on there pretty good. Voila! You have a Burger Time machine. Same fate awaits for the Asteroids machine. Uh, what I decided to do is I decided to put it in the center. Here it's a little bit harder because the Asteroids doesn't have the black thing on the bottom. So I did put this in here, a little Velcro, but if I ever change my mind, this does come off without ripping the sticker. I already tested that. Anyway guys, um, I'm all interested in uh, building your arcade. You can check out my channel for more great arcade one-up modifications. Until next time, take care.